storage locker. Bought this locker for $25. Just now opened it. Let's see what we get. Oops. This is a bear stag hunter bow. Bear makes quality bows, so that's a good one. Probably a couple hundred dollars right on right off the gate there. At least a hundred. I don't know what this is. <laughs> Some sort of Ninja Turtles chair. It's actually kind of cool. Ooh. Can do without the spider web. Spider egg. Things. All right. <coughs> Motocross helmet. Definitely women's. When I get home, it's starting to, it's starting to get a little cold out here already. So we we'll just start loading stuff up. Glad that's empty. Do want to check this and see if it's all on DVDs, it is. Just hoping maybe some video games are in here. Uh, I'll get that off before I open it. Well, these lamps aren't as nice as I had hoped. One's missing a shade, and the other looks like it's kind of broken shade on it. to the whole thing so that's what we're gonna do do is I'm gonna I'll crack this open here real quick if I can well I guess I'm not gonna crack that open real quick but we'll get a look inside see if there's any video game boxes it doesn't look like it some kids movies this will be kind of fun to go through anyway uh, what is this Tune is Chariots of Fire made in China, so it's not going to be. Doesn't seem to be working. That's probably going to be junk. A little, a little dirty, but nothing a little cleaning up won't fix. Nasty blankets, nasty clothes. Little kid clothes. Family pictures, but this might be half decent here. What is an Asian checkers board or chest or whatever? Huh. Looks like these guys are jade. This might be quite a find. Bang. What is this? Is this a coat? It's a coat. But there's no tags, which makes me wonder if this is like custom made, like legitimately this feels real furry. Fur-esque. I don't know. How to describe it. It feels like real fur. So, very soft. I don't know, that has potential though. Let's put that up there. And I don't know what's in here. Get this other 
clothing stuff out of the way. Let's open this up. I'll probably just end up selling these DVDs for maybe a buck a piece at a garage sale. Uh, between the two cabinets, I'm guessing I have at least 200 so should make an easy $200 off of this, hopefully. They have some good movies. I don't see Back to the Future. I don't see any uh, video games. That's what I was kind of hoping to find. But that's okay. Cinderella's. Well, this will be fun to go through. So. Okay. Let's see if we can put that back on, and now comes the fun part. Let's see how heavy this is. Pretty heavy. All right, we're gonna take the camera off. I'll be back. Um, if I find anything else worth checking out, I'll show you. If not, we'll show you everything when we unload, or I'll just put stuff up on the screen or whatever as I come across it. All right. All right. So I found this picnic basket looking thing uh, earlier in there. I just, I just lift up the lid and see what's inside and there is a laptop. Looks like it comes with Windows 7 Home Premium. <laughs> so I think it's rather old. This looks like a personal photo. It is, so I'm not going to show it. Another personal photo. Yep. I'm not going to show it. But yeah, I don't know anything about this tin, but this old laptop. Acer Aspire 1. I'll have to look that up. Maybe it's old enough to be valuable. Probably not, but I'll check it out.